Hi there, it's John and John. We are currently on our third day in New Zealand, and our journey has been nothing short of incredible so far. Our adventure began with an overnight stay at the Jet Park Hotel in Auckland after landing at the airport late at night. The next day, we moved to an Airbnb in Drury, where we enjoyed taking leisurely walks in the countryside and checking out the cows and the sheep along the way. On the second day of our trip, we headed down to Mata Mata, which is located approximately two hours away from Drury. Our main stop for the day was the Hobbiton movie set, which was an absolutely delight to explore. After that, we made our way to Lake Taupo with Airbnb. Unfortunately, Brandon has not been feeling well. As a result, my sister Susie has taken over the driving duties as we made our way to Wellington, which is a long drive of approximately 4 to 5 hours along the countryside. We have been a bit confused by the speed signs along the way. Nah. Despite this, our road trip has been an enjoyable and exciting experience with plenty of stunning views of the farms and nature in New Zealand. The drives have been quite relaxing and we have felt the gusty wind as we roll down the window. <laughs> We reached our third Airbnb in Lower Hub, Wellington after a long drive. The house is situated atop a hill, offering a stunning view of Wellington City and the harbour, which we can admire from our balcony. The property is spacious and has modern amenities, giving it a new and updated view. Once we had settled down into our B&B, we went out to downtown Wellington for dinner. I must say, it is a very challenging to find a restaurant that could accommodate our group of 10 people. After a few unsuccessful attempts, we finally settled on a Vietnamese restaurant. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 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 